<laughs> All right, motherfuckers. It's inappropriate episode fourteen. Shit, goddamn. Stats on YouTube, huh? Yeah, I know. Right. That's crazy. First on location fucking podcast is dope as hell. I'm glad to be here. We're here with Mike John. <laughs> How you doing, bro? I'm good. Thank you for having me. Nah, thank Thanks you. Thanks for coming through, actually. Thank you for yeah, having us here. This is dope as hell. It's going to be the start of something crazy. Like, the first one is always a special one. Right. Like, no bullshit. This is dope. This is dope. Well, tell people where we at. Where, what we doing? We at Instinct Tattoos. I don't know where to look. There's mad cameras in here. I know. <laughs> So, just pick whatever one. We are in. Yeah, just, 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 look at camera three. Mm-hmm. That one? Nah, I don't even matter. Fuck it. Okay. Just talking, 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 talking to the one. Yeah, we're the cameras on here. Um, 141 Main Street, Indian Orchard. And this is where I make the magic at. Where? That's dope. How long you been tattooing? Actually, last month was my 10 year anniversary. I did like a um, little discounted prices. Real discounted for the people that you know got tattooed back when I was doing it in the basement, so Word. it went pretty well. A lot of people, you know, I make people leave a deposit because people don't show up. So you know, you gotta. I, know how that goes. I gotta make money, right? Either way, so I make everybody leave a deposit. But so, what what was, what was like tattooing in the basement like? It was kind of the same thing. No, 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 no. It was the same thing, you know? Like, I I worked at Walmart before. I I started tattooing, and I started tattooing, and people already knew me. I'm from Springfield. I got mad people from Springfield that that mess with me already. So it was like, as soon as they knew I was tattooing, people started coming. Were you always into art and drawing and shit? Always, yeah. That's That's why people knew me already. In class, Central, back in the days, if you had a class with me, I was drawing. I passed. I did enough. <laughs> right, yeah. yeah I, did, I did enough to pass, but I, I was always drawing. So you do graffiti, like spray paint shit nah, too. I never got into that. Word. So. That shit. Sorry, that shit look tough as hell. Yeah, it's it's too long. Niggas get arrested. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not trying to get arrested over it. So it's like I never got into that. Just the school art, the the paper art, stuff like that. I picked up tattooing kind of quick. You know, kind of desperation almost. Some people don't. Some I know some people who can draw their ass off but can't tattoo. Like it's they, totally different. You know, you gotta have kind of some common sense. Yeah. <laughs> Cause you know, there's people out there that tattoo and don't have no common sense to about like you know like blood and passing shit around and that's that's crazy you know you got to learn what you're doing before you start to do it i didn't tattoo nobody until i tattooed myself i did all of this on myself when i first started tattooing you know just practice stuff i did my my knees up just shit you couldn't see (laughs) so you couldn't see and so you don't even count them anymore huh no you're just like i don't after you know what's crazy after i tattooed myself that many times i only got two other tattoos that Mm -hmm. shit hurts (laughs) <laughs> you ever had anybody like yeah. pass out on you? Yeah, mad people. I had people pass out. <laughs> mad people. Yeah. I had people pass out before I was even tattooing them. Oh my oh, god! I'm putting a stencil on and shit. It's like a thing. Oh you know my you, god! You know that shit hurts. I mean, yeah, but it hurts. shit. If you're you thinking about it too into. much and you oh, you you're psyching yourself out, you're, you're not breathing right. <laughs> There's people. That don't the eat. thing I don't know people's names because you know I, got, <laughs> I can tell all the stories. Yeah. I, mean, I can tell all the stories. I had a girl. One time we were, we put the stencil on already. It's already on, and we're 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 a four twenty friendly shop. I smoke all the time, so you know, we um we went out to smoke. I went on that back porch right there, and we're we're all standing on the back porch, and we're smoking and shit. And she, I guess she's just thinking about her tattoo. She's not ready yet. <laughs> she's not ready, so she's just out there, and we're smoking weed and chilling. And she just fucking passed out right Maybe there. Maybe I just had some fire. Yeah, it was a fire. <laughs> yeah, yeah so I'm fucking oh, yeah. wow. I so. Where did I get that from? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I need that plug. <laughs> was it her first tattoo? Um, No, it was actually a cover-up. Oh, my God. It was a cover-up, so, you know, 
Maybe she didn't want the nigga's name off her. No, it was, it was crazy. <laughs> it was crazy. <laughs> I the think ghost of that dick <laughs> 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 How do you feel about name tattoos? You, you, you suggest I tell people, good? I warn people, but like, some people are adamant about it. You know, so I, I that do won't it. happen to me. You know, the money is If if they about it, they about it. I give them one warning. After that, if they still want it, I'll do it. Where? Okay. Nah, they'll shit. come back for me to, for the cover that up. That shit is real. Like I said, that shit happened to me. Like, yeah, like, that shit you got a name? Yeah. Where I is it? What you got? Chest, too. I, I need chest? that shit covered up. Chest, too. Yeah. I need that shit covered up. It was the very first tattoo. That shit happened on accident. See, that's a funny story. How you get a tattoo on accident? I was drunk as shit. It was my first weekend in San Diego. <laughs> drunk as shit. See, man, I'm always <laughs> drunk. All the, all the dumb like, stories I got. Behavior mm-hmm. All the dumb stories I got. Me being drunk as shit. Like, literally, I woke up. I woke up, I would scratch my chest, and that shit was just like, ah, I was like, what the fuck? Look down, that shit was there, I was like, no. What's the name? Whose name is it? Man, we don't talk about her. You don't talk about nah, her? Nah. Is it a first girlfriend? Yeah, everybody in this room knows shit. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I know. Not everybody. Not everybody. Yeah, you know. <laughs> but, but still. One of my friends, one of my best friends, his first tattoo was his girlfriend's name and shit like that. And then I had to cover it up too. Again, I did his first tattoo and then I covered up my own tattoo. That I That's did. job security. I know. <laughs> yeah, that shit I can make real. it happen. That shit is real. That's dope. you like, I see where I was going with this. <laughs> all of the shit, especially all the stuff I did in my basement, if I, if, if people come back, you know, I'll hook them up. I give them, you know, even back then, you know, like even all of this, this is all the shit I did in my basement. It's not, it's not the best shit, but it's, it's not horrible. So, you know, even those people back then. You did some lions on, on my girl. She wants them, she wants them shit touched up. Yeah, I'm with it. A grip would go too. Uh, yeah, it had to be, I know. It was a while ago. It, it, it might've been on Boston Road. It was so on that, Boston Road. So that had to be six plus years ago. That shit was, <laughs> that was a while six ago. Six plus years ago, the, the progress. You can see, if you follow me on Instagram or Facebook, nah, you can see the real. progress. It's, it's a real. thing too, because you know, <clears throat> I didn't do like no apprenticeship or nothing. Like I said, I went from Walmart I tattooed myself a bunch, and then, you know, it's just like fucking learning. You see you see what you've done before. You see how it healed. It's it's all a learning process, so it's like you can tell who who's actually with it and who's not because of, like, growth. Yeah, because, you know, you can see, you know, if you're tattooing for fucking 20 years and your shit still look the same, right. <laughs> this ain't the job crazy. for you, my nigga. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> This ain't, this ain't the one for you. And it's like, if you're not making any progress, you're not fucking doing anything, then it's like, you're kind of stuck. You're going to be in the same place. That's what we, um like, even with the people that work here, everybody, I try to push it a lot. I'm not the boss or nothing. I'm not the head guy and shit, but I'm the oldest. And like I told you guys before, I be trying to push as much fucking knowledge on people because it's, it's better to fucking tell people before they fucking have to deal with it themselves. I'm on that shit. I got kids. I got two kids. My oldest daughter's um 12. She just went to sixth grade. So it's like, yeah, that shit's real. I heard that. I heard some breaths on there. That shit's real. I don't. I didn't feel that old until I to say it like that. My oldest daughter's nah, 12. Yeah. Right? Know <laughs> She's about to be fucking. Shit is real. So you know, I try to push as much fucking knowledge on people. I tell people to do it yourself. It's been 10 years since I fucking had a boss. Since I had anybody tell me what to do, what time to come in, that, that shit is real. Ill. Like, you know? That shit is Ill. Right. So it's like, if you could do it yourself, fucking do it yourself. Because. How do you feel about other artists in the city? I fucking love other artists in the city. It's crazy how, how, um, how it, there's not much communication between people. Because, I, like I said earlier, too, it's like you have you have to fucking meet other people you it's we're all the same city springfield's not a big tattoo city springfield is not like you know people don't know how much people actually pay for tattoos yo you know you see that shit on the internet you you don't know that it fucking took 30 hours to do that shit that shit's you you never know you know it's like i do all these tattoos and people see them and they think they're nice but all of this shit is just one session i get one lucky person that comes in or i'm the lucky person but somebody comes in it's like 400 dollars they got and I'm like, fucking yes, let's, <laughs> let's fucking do this because we can really start some shit that's like, but it's still just starting it. It's still just like, you know, 
But because you never know, you know, you you got tattoos, you know, you know that healing process. You never know, if niggas, niggas, you can fuck it up yourself. I can do everything I can do here, but once you get home, that's on you, you know. So you never know how. How do you take <laughs> care of a tattoo? Once it's it's, it's simple. It's it, everybody does their own thing. It depends on how you heal. You know your life. There's people that that fucking that just don't heal good. Like my aunt, my aunt, whatever she gets a scar or whatever, it just fucking it like keloids. Makes a, yeah, keloids. It makes a fucking real scar. No matter what happens to her, it could be a little thing. So it's just like you got to know yourself. You know if you if you heal fast and shit like that. Most most thing I tell everybody is just. Like when you see it, you see like the fucking blood come out. You know, you see even the first fucking week, you'll see like it don't look like blood, but it's just moisture. You clean that shit off. Should be itchy as yeah. fuck. Yeah, <laughs> after, I'm after, like, ah, it's still the same thing. Hell you know, yeah, it's a foreign like, object. Ah. It's a foreign object in your body. You know, so your body every time, it what what happens most of the time is like you'll get you'll get bumped or you'll get scratched on your tattoo. And then after that, you'll feel it for like a week because, yeah. because you know, your body recognizes that foreign object again. As soon as something happens to it, your body will recognize that, you all know, this ain't supposed to be here either. And then it'll be itching again. It'll be like, like you just got it done again. But, you know, I what I tell people, too. clean that, that fucking moisture that, that, that fucking happens in the healing process in that first week. Clean it off as little bit of, I tell, I'll, I used to say, when I first started, I used to say um, A&D ointment. That was the thing, you know? But now it's Aquaphor. Aquaphor works better. It's in the same aisle, just a little bit further down. <laughs> you I know? heard A&D you know? like, takes off the ink or some stupid shit like that. It's not like that. What it is is people put too much of that shit, you know? It's like fucking wrapping your arm in saran wrap. If Even right now, if you don't have no tattoo and you wrap your arm in saran wrap, what's going to happen? That shit's gonna sweaty. be fucking sweaty as shit. It's gonna be moisture, and it's just like taking a bath. Your skin gets soggy, and that allows your body to just push that ink out. So you want to put as little as possible on there. You mm. just want to have it like lotion, you know, just thin, thin right. layer on there. And like having easy. that shit dry as shit ain't fucking good. No, either. like don't fucking have don't Another put nothing thing, on it. I be th I got so much to say. Yeah, go ahead. Go. <laughs> this is your shit. Go ahead. It's like black people. It's 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 a crazy thing for white people compared to black people. Because a white person can't say that fucking it's harder to tattoo a black person. <laughs> you know, a white person can't publicly be like, yo, it's mad harder to tattoo a black person. <laughs> but me as a black person, it's fucking mad harder to tattoo a black person, you know? <laughs> it's totally different. I can do a tattoo on a white person like a and it'll take an hour. Canvas, like. you know, yeah, you know, I can do a tattoo on a white person and it'll take an hour and I do it on a black person and it'll take fucking four hours. Oh, shit. You know, because you got a tattoo totally different. No word. You can't do certain things. You can't do these colors and if you are going to do colors, you got to do it in a big area because otherwise it's going to look like fucking black. It's gonna look like gray. It's gonna. It's, you see people. Yeah, that's I, my thing. I, I know. I've seen people with tattoos who don't need fucking tattoos, shitty, like, shittiest like, yo, of the like. shitty tattoos. <laughs> Even the people that fucking, you know, I don't hate on anybody. The people that are tattooing in the street, there's some of them that's nice. There's some of them, like you said, there's some of them that are dope artists, but they don't know anything about tattooing, so they're fucking up people. It's. It's it's been helping me. I be doing mad cover ups. <laughs> <laughs> I Word. do mad fucking cover ups, but it's like I've gotten tattoos drunk. Before. Right, you know it's the thing, and it's it's not up to you. It's not your right. fault. It's the artist's fault. The artist should tell you, you know, don't get this fucking tattoo. Don't do it at this size. Don't do it because you don't have enough money. If you don't have enough money, tell me you don't have enough money, and I'll do an outline, and we can fucking finish it later. Don't do it fucking so small, especially on a black person. Because, you know, all of this shit, look at these. When I first started, that's what I mean. I learned on myself, you know. All of this shit, all these clocks is pointed at my birthday. You don't know what the fuck this shit says. <laughs> it's way too small. It's All of that shit is way too small. And then I learned after that shit, and I did these words. And then you can read them, you know. You can read exactly what it says. It says right there, Father, forgive me. I mean, Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do. I don't know if it's from the Bible. I know it's from the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's from Lauren Hill and I love it. Yeah, so, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> right, right. That's what I know it from Lauren Hill. And Jesus so, said pray. Right. All this shit, this was, um, if we was mobile, I'd show you too, because this shit right here, 
ashy as fuck, first off. Don't worry about that. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about <laughs> that. <laughs> 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 Don't worry about that. But this is all stuff that, you know, I got my first tattoo kit. And it's just shit that was on there, you know? I don't do it on anybody else, but it's in my room on my wall for, like, like memory's sake, you know? Where I started at to where I'm at now. I got a bunch of that shit in my room. But that's one of the things right there. All of this shit, you know? Just, that shit had to be a weird-ass fucking angle all of you it. on yourself. When, you know what's crazy? When I did this one, I think it was this one, yeah. Because I was like this the whole time. Yeah, see? That shit's weird as fuck. You're right. Fucking four days or something like that. After yeah. My my these two fingers was fucking up dead. All of this right here, because this took like an hour and a half for me to do. Because first off, I ordered the wrong needles, so I did it with like a fucking I did it with like a one liner. That's a common misconception. A one liner is the smallest fucking needle you could ever use. You, you know, you use it for fucking doing hair or something like that. So I did all of my tattoos like with a one liner. So I had to fucking go over it fucking ten times each line and shit like that. Took mad fucking long to do it. And then after like my hand was like that, and these fucking three fingers or two fingers like that was just numb for like four days and shit. Like fucking <laughs> straight dead. <laughs> what do you think is the most sensitive area to get tattooed? Anywhere that's ticklish. Oh man. Like I said already, that shit hurts. I ain't got tattooed. You got your ribs. Long. You got your ribs. No. Down? Hell no. Yeah, that shit, that shit is My worst tattoo is this one right here, and you can tell because that shit ain't finished yet. <laughs> that shit. Oh, that man, shit, man, you know. Man. I got that's big plans. I don't like it. But I anywhere that's ticklish, inside your body, anywhere that's not touched, you know, if it's if it's regular, outside of your body is good, really. Because it's, it's touched all the time. People will always say about your face, like, oh, your face would hurt so much. Your face is the most exposed place. You know, it's winter, fucking cold, heat, fucking... Everything. What do you think about face tattoos? It depends on what it is. It looks dope. Some of them, I like the above the eyebrow. You gotta, you gotta go to jail. And just, <laughs> yeah. you, gotta, you gotta not have a future. Right. <laughs> but I like those ones. Those are nice. The minimum wage. Yo, that shit is real as fuck. <laughs> Thank you for saying that, that though. That, that one looks right. nice though. I'm the, I'm the right person. You never um, went to a barber shop and like they had some fucking sharp ass clippers in the oh back of your God. fucking neck. I'd be like, yo, goddamn, how do people see get that tattoos? tattoos? That's how do people shit. get that tattoos? That's, that's, what, I tell tattoos. that's okay. what I tell people. That's that's what it feels like. How? It feels like getting a, a fucking shitty ass lineup. Sharp ass. <laughs> 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 like somebody's fucking your lineup up. Yeah. I do so many people's first tattoos. I can't. And it's crazy because they take it the best. I got some people that got mad tattoos, and every fucking time they they're fucking crying about it. Like, yeah. <laughs> that's that shit though, too. Cause it does fucking hurt. That shit it fucking does hurt. hurts. But it's yeah, addicting like, as hell. You, you know what's can't gonna get do? one My tattoo. last tattoo I got, I was like, for a, the week after, I was just pissed at this nigga. Like, I do that. Do my do that. I was fucking pissed. Nigga. Like, yo, you just he didn't need to go that hard. My shit is fucking hurts, nigga. My shit is like, I was pissed. Like, yo. But my shit healed dope. It looks dope. But that shit fucking hurt, yo. So every time, I'm, I'm one of those people, you know? Like, you want to take a break or something? How you, how you feel? Nah, yo, I'd be like, yo, push through. <laughs> push, get this shit <laughs> over with. I look at it like time. I look at it like time. Like, yo, yo, it's the time. Like, I'm not about to just sit here and wait. Let's get this shit the fuck over with. The, the more work you do, the faster it gets done. The faster get the fuck out of here and just deal with this fucking pain because it hurts. It hurts a lot. Oh, yeah. Like this shit, this shit mm -hmm. killed. Like, like literally, so my arm went dead. Like, I, I had to keep stopping. With How the they have you done? Huh? How do you have you laying down or something? Did he have you nah, laying down? I was like, yeah, I was like, see, this. that's the thing. That that makes it worse. That's that's the thing about coming to a tattoo shop compared to going to somebody's fucking house. Nah, it was that. It was, it was at my crib. He came to me. Yeah, and that shit is crazy. And how much tattoo equipment you got in your shit? It's a <laughs> None. Exactly, my That's my point. Right? That's the thing. It's like, you know, I did it too. I was on like books and shit. Yeah, exactly. You gotta, you gotta <laughs> fucking improvise. Yo, you know, that's why I don't even, I don't even, come, I don't come out the shop no more. I want my because it's like you shop. want the same quality in everything that you do. You want the same quality, so you gotta fucking, you know, if I come to your house and I fucking forget my regular black ink and I gotta use another black ink. You don't know that shit, but I know that shit, and your right. fucking tattoo's gonna look like it. 
So I don't I don't even fucking do that shit no more, you know? And especially I tattoo in Springfield, it's a bunch of fucking hood motherfuckers that gotta go on Facebook and be like, yo, this nigga fucking sucks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yo, for Fuck real. Fuck this nigga. Yo, that you know? shit is Ill. It's real, you know? Niggas are real as fuck. I don't give a it's, fuck. Yeah. It's if you that's what I mean. That's why I fuck with you guys too, because y'all don't got nobody talking shit. It's all love. It's all, you know. It's in you know, I like I said, I appreciate you guys coming and hollering at me, yeah. Pass it to this this fella here. <laughs> <laughs> He's with it. We're with it. Fucking you have a favorite uh style? Um no. I try to, you know, I'm trying to make as much money as possible, so I try to fucking whoever come in and ask for whatever I'm about it, you know. My favorite style is um, just the hardest shit. <laughs> I want to get better, you know. I, I'm trying to fucking improve, so the hardest shit that I can do, I want to try to do it, and I want to do it on the people like you guys, you know, the people that are cool with me and fuck with me, and it's like, you know, if it don't, it don't fucking work out how we was planning it, I'll, I'll fucking hook you up and we'll be all right. You know? <laughs> I want to fucking get better. I want to learn what happens when you do this and fucking what happens when you do this. I don't, I didn't have nobody teaching me. So I think, I'm still learning that up. I think portraits are like the most scariest thing to fucking ask for. Mm -hmm. Tell me a fucking about it. Like, yo, like, yo, people will be asking for portraits and I'll be like, yo, who <laughs> did that thing? Like, right. that shit Imagine, don't look like. Imagine somebody coming with a, like a, a picture of their grandma and shit. Like, <laughs> Put that on me. <laughs> what if their kids are ugly to start with, though? I know. You, <laughs> made, you made them look as, as exactly how the picture looks, man. Right? You gotta hold it up after it. Right? <laughs> oh, hey, yo. That shit's the word. That shit's Your baby's eye is crooked? Nah, nah, nah. Man, let me show you something right here. In this picture you brought me. Man, you about to learn today. Your baby's eye is crooked here, right? Damn, too. I don't know if he was squinting. I know. I'm crazy. You know, I ain't seeing nothing or nothing, but... That shit. Your baby eye was crooked when it got here. I know. Yeah. So, like, that. How many times do you go, like... I like I I guess I guess I'll do that on you. Like you hear like when I first of, started. How many times you get passive aggressive with your yeah, just like, <laughs> All right. When All I first right. started, I used to do it more. When I first started, because you know it's, it's still that kind of kind of desperation. You know, you kind of do whatever because, like I said, well I don't know if I said that after when I started at Walmart and then and, and I quit Walmart in that first month. After a month of tattooing, I quit Walmart and like I said, that was my last job. So you know. After that, it was like, I'll kind of do whatever the tattoos. I did some fucking crazy tattoos on some people, especially in the beginning. People come in fucking high or fucking all that shit and they had money. I'll fucking tattoo whatever the fuck they ask on me. I tattooed a, a, a digital scale. <laughs> oh my oh, God. A digital scale on this girl's lower back. She has a future. All right. <laughs> Right, you yeah. she, she, she tramped it. She tramped it. Tramped it. Yo, the digital scale. I was about to ask. Hold on, they didn't even need. They Yeah, she brought the digital scale with her. I wanted to look like this. Yeah, I took a picture. It had, it had it. crumbs on it. Yeah. That shit was in use. Yeah. And we don't leave crumbs like that, my nigga. I see. Oh shit. <laughs> Why is it scale so ashy? Right, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that shit. That shit is, shit is real. real. That Digital shit is. scale. I tattooed that on somebody. I, I tattooed seen, them. Oh, I, nah, go ahead. Go, go, ahead, ahead, go, ahead, go ahead. I got stories. I tattooed mad crazy shit on people when I first started. I started saying no later. <laughs> <laughs> I started saying no later because people were fucking. Like, why'd you let me do this? Oh, I'm you? your fucking mom. <laughs> yeah, you know, like, I'm sorry, like, you had me. Yeah, I've had somebody come <laughs> there and dog piss. That's how it is. Yes, nigga. Yo, like, people that shit come is back crazy. Pissed. People will come back pissed for, like, a bad healing process. You ever had a bad healing process? Yeah, my back mm -hmm. was fucked up. What happened? No, no, no. Sometimes you have a bad healing process, and then the tattoo's fine after. <laughs> like, you know, it, once it's done healing, completely it's just fucking fine after. Nah, my shit's like, my shit, my skin raised. Yeah? Oh, yeah, that, that's just going too deep. That's like yeah. that keloid shit. That's going too deep. That's going too far. That was in Cali, too, some Asian. Fuck. Back. 
an Asian fuck. You know there was like a big tiger on the front. I was like, I'm going in there and getting one now. Drunk you know what's as crazy? shit. Me and my girl went to California and I was expecting it to be fucking tattoo cap. Nah, it is fire. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? We went fucking my first time. I, I turned fucking 31, and so it was, it was. I just turned 30, and my first time we went to San Diego, we went for two weeks. So we rented a car in San Diego, and we fucking drove all the way up to California, and then we fucking went to fucking. Um, except for 101, Utah, there probably went Arizona. Utah, Arizona. Ain't hey, shit out Nevada. there. Right. No, we went to, we went to the Grand Canyon. We went to fucking Vegas. Josh Vegas. 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 Hey, that was Josh Vegas. Vegas. whack as fuck. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> no, we had a condo with a jacuzzi right, right. outside. <laughs> right. 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 I just fucking with you. I just fucking with you. I never even been there before. You didn't go with the right people. I've never even been there. I'm just messing with you. Big bitches. Nah, just kidding. <laughs> nah, I love, I love, I love California. Listen, Listen, look at me. I went to some shit. That was dope. We did our thing. Church of Steel. And two weeks. I got a oh, hair test. Right? Matter of fact, so fire. fire. My, my ribs I got done in San Diego by a Russian dude who spoke no English. So uh -huh. that, was, that was amazing. How was it? Is the tattoo dope? Yeah, I think it's dope. It's not. It's just. It's just. I'm saying. It's not. Yeah. Crazy. Okay. So, so national so, security shit is that. Marines going to the shop I worked at. It was this. Yo. Nah, listen. Listen. Bro. Listen. Was, it was at real. the first I tattoo I worked at, there was this real. Russian dude. His name was like Vitali or something like that. <laughs> he didn't speak much English or nothing like that. His his fucking grand when he when he wanted to get a job, his grandma came in with him. And she was like, yo, this is my son, or this is my grandson. He wants to work here. Why <laughs> does a grandma know better English? Yeah. That's, uh, a, that's a bad I, no, sign. He was, no, he was real. <coughs> he just came from Russia. Maybe, I don't know. Nobody <laughs> fuck with him, though. I know that much. It's a security but threat. But he was fucking nice as shit. Word. He was nice as fucking shit, yo. And Word. he did tattoos. That's the thing, though, because he would do a portrait, even now, I'm in my, I'm, I'm not the best I can be, but I'm as good as I have been, and it takes me about fucking two and a half to three hours to do a good portrait, you know. This motherfucker took like seven hours, nigga. <laughs> God damn. Shit was fire. It was dope. But that, that shit took like seven hours, God and he would use damn. a fucking tiny ass needle, and the tiny ass needle thing is like, I think it's like a prison shit. Yeah, you yeah, said so he probably had tons of time yeah, to practice the gulag. Right. <laughs> <laughs> that's, 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 that's what we thought. Hey, nobody, that's why I say nobody fuck with Vitaly, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as you're going to the gulag, you're going to the grandma in America. In America. She knows it. She's going to get you a job. That's likely what I think happened. Or some fucking Russian mafia wasn't fucking with this nigga anymore. He had to go. But that he was nice. It took him a long fucking time, but he was fucking nice. That nigga's probably in the back somewhere. With a sniper right now, like no, nah, I, mm -hmm. I don't think so. <laughs> I told a few people dead. about him already. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's why I, I always tell people about people, yo. You know, like I'm, I've never been people. I, I had two apprentices. You know, people that come in and ask me specifically, yo, like, yo, can you teach me what you do? I'm like, I don't even know that much. I'm like I said, I taught myself, but you know. If if they're about it, ten then, years though, man. Yeah, I had enough time. You know, if you if you're if you're a smart person, that's you said the central shit. Central, I, I appreciate central for real because they they did something for me. You know, for a lot <laughs> I'm of here, a lot, Yeah, smart. that's what I mean. I know a lot of people from central that are fucking doing Working shit and doing all shit. of those shit. Yeah, yeah, for real. Some there's people out. There's other people too. This niggas is doing shit, but you know. Like just random <laughs> shit, like other shit that everybody else ain't doing, you know. There's there's mad people from Central that's doing their own thing. I think it. I think it's blatant. Like I think it's yeah, like yeah, like, for real, you know. And screaming like <laughs> for real. Right. Right. I, I, I know. I do know a couple of people from other high schools that are it's, doing it's, shit. It's, it's more. Are you from Springfield for real? Like yeah, from, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. You know. Right. I think I, I think it's a Springfield thing, yo. There's people. There's people that you know. You get knowledge just. Like like fucking elephants and shit. I, 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 dude, it's like like commutative knowledge. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You, no, elephants they they learn shit. <laughs> you know? Elephant is born. Nah, they're smart as fuck. Yeah, they, they're born and they, they know they fucking which memory. way to go. They know which way to go and they know fucking all of that shit. They can go fucking in their route, the same route that their grandparents went. Right? <laughs> Straight up, that's yeah. like commutative knowledge. That's like, they, they, it's in their DNA, the shit that their family has learned. I think our peers, period, are just the shit. Like, 
Like just in general, that's what I mean. It's like it's like a fucking change. thing. It's gonna change. Like people are learning different. Like you know, our teachers maybe in our generation or maybe just in general, people are learning different, and they're fucking they're doing things their own way and they're making it. And that's what I that's what I fucking try to try to push. You know, I try to push people doing shit their own way. You know, making it in their own way. That's just damn shit. Right, you know, you know, <coughs> and like connect. And I didn't even realize that was Jaw over there. <laughs> <laughs> that's, why and that's my nigga. We're from way, way back. I know Jaw. I think like Walk to school together. yeah, man, way Damn. fucking back. Yeah. 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 <laughs> What's the biggest piece you done? Right, how long? Um, it's it's weird sessions? because that's that's the thing. Sessions wise, um. 40 plus, 40 plus hours. On one piece? I want one, one piece or one, uh, one, one piece. piece? One piece, I'd probably say seven or eight hours. Yeah. One piece. That's still So we um, what's the 40 hour thing? Man, just just people in general. Just working on the yeah, same person. My girl got mad, oh, mad hours. LB, my dude right there, he got mad hours, you know? Mad, just, you know, sessions and shit. And that's the thing too, like with, with like, I know what my Facebook say and shit, and you know for my pricing and shit but it, it depends you know i make my own shit you know so if i know you you know if i know you fuck with the, the thing say it depends you know niggas relationship you know who you fuck with and nah, who don't fuck with shit with my dj right you know you know who fuck right. with you and who don't fuck with you so you. it's like all right, all right. you know I could do it. But let it you be know? somebody I don't know. Right, right. Full nigga, price. Up. <laughs> Full I'm 20 price. an hour, my nigga. I need my deposit. Yo. I need my... Yeah, Facts. that's it. You know? Facts. Oh, you got... You threw this person, you know? that person? It oh. depends. All right. It's like who you who you Full fuck charge, with, you know? nigga. Yeah, like. There's niggas, I feel like in Springfield, there's a whole bunch of niggas that just... They just say, oh, Mike Jones is fucking 120 an hour. You know, I'm not, I can't afford that. I'm not going there, you know, straight up. It's like, you know, come see me. If I fuck with you, you know what's up. You know, I'm like, I'll, I'll, right. I'll fuck with you. You know, let me know what you got. You know, that's it. Period. Right. Hit me up. Yo, I got a fucking 160. All right, cool. Holla at me. 60 bucks is my minimum. I won't do nothing less than that because it costs me fucking 30 bucks to fucking tattoo you at all. My inks, my my caps, my fucking needles, my fucking machine, the music, the, the room. Did that just open by itself? Ghostly, ghostly style. I know. See, I ghost <laughs> all of us. That's that shit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's, That's that shit. Some damn weird shit. Damn, damn. No. Yeah, she's gonna do this. But yeah, it's like <laughs> yeah, yeah, all of that shit. <laughs> How many tests do you do in a day? Well, obviously depends on the size. Like, no, 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 not even. Don't, not even that. Yeah. It's just me. Word. It's just me. I, it's like a thing because now, now I'm in the in the in the best position I've ever been in because like right now we all kind of we all have the same what's going on in the shop. Every other shop I worked at, somebody else owned it. <coughs> so now you know, I try to just get people in here because two of the people that work here were my apprentices, and I got I got high standards right off the rip. So I know that these motherfuckers is nice, you know. So you know, even other people, you know, come in. If I can't tattoo you, these motherfuckers will tattoo you, and I stand behind them. Their work and everything, you know? So, but it's like, I tattoo right now, I probably, at most, maybe three per people in a day. Back when I was fucking struggling. Like, in my birthday, that nigga did like 10. That's a tattoo party, though. Oh, that's a tattoo party. Said, that's different, you know? <laughs> but in a day, my regular shit, because, you know, like I said, this is my only job. I don't do nothing else, so I try to fucking make it so every day that I work, I have somebody. So I don't, I don't, I don't fucking, I won't do too many people in a day if my month is not full I already. Just, I just did some nigga math in my head, and you <laughs> make some good money. Please, please explain. Some I could. nigga math, I just rounded up to the nearest ten. <laughs> <laughs> the nearest hundred. Yeah, right, real quick. Four, five, so it's six. like, damn, you do three a day, you do that, come talking about me. Oh, no. so, oh, no. Like, it's like, fine, well, it's just five so days, and then Saturdays, you're probably right. more than thing. three. So it's like, them nigga you math. It's like, damn, you made, right. you made some good money. It's like, it's and you thing. said, you said, we said 120 an hour? Yeah. Right, exactly. But listen, too, so, remember what I said before that? Surgeon. That if people <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, let me, let me, let me explain it. Let me explain it. So if if people know me, if I know you, then it's not it's not one twenty an hour for the most part because most people don't have one twenty an hour. Most people 
Let me switch real quick. Before I was tattooing, I got one tattoo, my nigga. <laughs> I had one tattoo before I started tattooing. Mm. Ain't that... Don't other artists look at that crazy? Like... It I don't give a fuck. Not, not that, not that. I'm just saying. Yeah, that would, you would don't you, have right now. If, if you see somebody tattooing with one tattoo, how would you look at that? That they didn't have money to pay for it before they. <laughs> <laughs> because that was my, that was my Word. shit. You know. Word. You know, before I started tattooing, I, would, I, I didn't have money to get a tattoo. I wouldn't go to anybody. I would hit up fucking Bill, fucking. Yeah, um, man, you know. Would. You know another thing. Pay that nigga too. enough money, and Bill is nice. I seen dope fucking shit that Bill did. Period. I seen dope shit that Bill has fucking done. And I don't know motherfucking... who this guy is, but I know mad people. Mad that people that got man. fucking shitty yeah, tattoos yeah, from him. Yeah. <laughs> because you can podcast. you can hit up Bill. And say, <laughs> you can hit up Bill and say, "Yo, Bill, I got forty dollars. I want a tattoo," and he'll come and tattoo you. Period. Man. That nigga's about his money. He'll come and tattoo you for forty dollars. But if you hit up Bill and say I got four hundred dollars and I want to get a tattoo, he's gonna come and tattoo you the same shit. But it's gonna be fire. I promise you. Mm. You know, it costs money to tattoo people. It mm. costs money to get there. It costs money to fucking be there. All of that shit. All of your time. Make money for your time. Real talk, cause it costs money. You know. Spe oh my god, yeah, motherfuckers. I don't even know. I think I make so much money. <laughs> Let me tell you about tax time, my nigga. Oh, shit. <laughs> Let me tell you about tax time, right? Because y'all niggas pay me in cash. You know so, you know, I still got to pay the shop. And then the shop says that I made fucking... The shop tells the government that I, I gave them fucking $60,000. And then the fact that I paid the shop makes it that I actually gave the shop $30,000. And then the fact that I pay for my supplies and everything every year, that makes it that I gave the shop fucking $20,000. God damn. And then I'm still paying taxes at once. <laughs> right then, when, when I file my taxes, when you guys file your taxes, I don't, I don't get no money. I got to pay fucking $10,000 God damn. back when... Yeah, motherfuckers is paying me cash right now. You think I'm fucking it putting works. some money aside to fucking pay the taxes later? <laughs> I'm not even going. <laughs> I'm not even going. Nah. My niggas just gave me six hundred dollars. That's real. That's real. Your boy is balling. Wesley Snipes on Hey, your boy is nah. I'm good. Yeah, it's I'm like, good. Where? My girl helps me handle yeah. all of that shit. Yeah. But I, you know, that. Word. <laughs> it's, that shit is fucking crazy. It costs money to fucking be here. These motherfuckers, I'm paying for just knowing motherfuckers. <laughs> you know, nigga hit me up and they're like, I got sixty dollars. I gotta give the shop fucking thirty bucks of that. Mm. You know, damn. And then remember how much I told you I, I make? I mean, I gotta pay to even tattoo you, motherfuckers, thirty bucks. Like, <laughs> mm. so I'm hooking motherfuckers up. I'm, I'm, you know, people tell me the quality of stuff I'm doing. People are charging a lot more than I'm charging, nice. and and I don't charge that much because I know where the fuck I'm at. I was Your raised here. Is super dope, man. Quality I'm trying work, yo. No bullshit. I'm trying, but like I said, I'm still guessing. Yeah. Kobe. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, you know, I'm just, I'm guessing. You know, I'm, I'm trying new shit on people, and you know, I gotta try it on the, on the, the people that I know. You know. Come holla at me. Let me try some shit on you. <laughs> <laughs> Let me try some shit on you. I'm trying to get better, shit. you know? You know? It's always down to get fucked That's what I mean. What's I got a schedule. Know? The people, that's that. That's mm -hmm. what comes first, literally. If you leave me a deposit, if, if I don't got no money from you, I'm ignoring the fuck out of you, really. Mm -hmm. It's too many people hitting me up. It's it's too many people on the internet. I don't got I don't I can't afford to pay an assistant and a, and a fucking everybody to, to look at it for me, so it's just me. I got a family, I got kids, I got shit to do, and I can't just be looking at your shit all day. <laughs> so, you know, if you didn't give me any money, I don't really shit, give a fuck. we could make a deposit right <laughs> now. <laughs> what you need? Uh, That's the thing. Once you give me some money, here. once you give me that $40 deposit, well, we then got, I kind of have to fuck well, with you, right? I need, I need, a, whole, I need, a, whole, I need a whole back, <laughs> need a whole back piece, though. Right, then I got you $40. <laughs> You're going to get a date. <laughs> and a receipt. Right, and a receipt, and, and then 
that it's up day. To you to come down. Right. Come down. That day, and I got you. Listen, nigga. Other than that, y'all gonna ignore the fact that there's Chinese print on these bills. They can see that right there. They can see that. I'm telling you. I was about to be like, yo, why y'all hearing the money around like that? Y'all trying to do something right now? I'm with it. Or it's a ride, you probably take it. Right. Nah, yo, fuck that. I'm oh, afraid yeah, yeah, to get my elbow done. That shit is real. I got numbing cream. I charge extra for that, though. <laughs> yeah, yo, that shit right? that hurt. Is that shit hurt. Cause like this shit, like, I can put it on this hour before your tattoo, and you won't feel it. For real? For the yeah, as long as you keep it on, the the amount of time you you keep that. Numbing cream. That shit, that's the amount of time that you, that shit, you, got, you can feel that shit in your bones. Like, <laughs> He's like, what? Nigga. I got a bottle of it this big and it costs 50 bucks. You know, you know so I gotta charge motherfuckers. Oh, yeah. I gotta throw an extra dump. You do, you you do, do that. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I gotta throw an extra dump. <laughs> you, you do piercings yourself? You no. Gotta, gotta do I don't fuck with that. I don't want to stab through you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm good with it going in and coming out. I don't want to go through. <laughs> Word. So I don't do piercings. We 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 had a piercer here actually. They don't fuck they don't fuck with us no more. Damn. It's, it's we like I said we went through so many different owners. It's crazy to have somebody like if you own a tattoo shop and you don't tattoo, all your artists are gonna fucking hate you because they never you don't know you don't know how much fucking goes into it. And that's where you get those people that fucking do it on the street and they don't care because they're just trying to get money. But the people that care about their name. And, and what's going out there, and no matter what you do, somebody's gonna tell somebody else that you did it. And that's what you gotta think of every time, no matter what tattoo you're doing, no matter how much money they're spending on it, you gotta fucking do it to the best of your ability, and people don't do that. Especially a tattoo party, when people are coming to your house, and there's fucking 13 people there, yeah, that's a lot of money. Yeah, you want that money, but you're gonna do some fucked up tattoos, my nigga. <laughs> you're in somebody's kitchen, so you gotta fucking put somebody's leg up on the fucking table. <laughs> fucking, you know, it's too much. You know, you're gonna fuck your shit up and you're gonna have a fucked up tattoo out there. You're gonna scar them fucking for life, literally. <laughs> that shit is for life. So, you know, you gotta take all of that shit seriously. And even like the customer and the healing process, your healing process is super fucking important. You know, take that shit seriously. Motherfuckers come and get a tattoo in the summertime and then <laughs> want to go swimming and shit. My nigga, that's going to fuck your tattoo up, mm. you know? And if you are, the best bet is the ocean, not in a pool. I'm not saying it's I'm not saying it's good either way, but the ocean is better. Man, stay the fuck away from that shit. Right. Stay but away. it's summertime. You're going to want to be in the sun. The sun is going to cook your tattoo. You're going to fucking that sweat. Too. That's a thing. Black people versus white people. Every time you, you you get a tattoo and it's summertime and your skin tans and then it and it fucking goes back to your wintertime tone. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know you get darker and lighter for summer and winter and shit like that. But every time you get darker, your ink gets darker with you, but it's not gonna get lighter with you. So it just keeps getting darker every summer, every fucking every all the sun. All of that shit is just going to keep getting darker and darker every time because it's changing with the tone, but it can't change back because it's not living. It's just fucking in there. So it's just going to keep getting darker and darker. Yeah, there's, there's a whole bunch of shit that people don't know in general. That's why they're just getting tattooed by anybody, by anybody in the streets doing all these little tiny words and shit. I don't do words on people if they're not a certain size. Because I know it's going to fucking spread out and then you're not going to be able to read it. I've dealt with it already. That's why I don't do it no more. I'd be like, nope. <laughs> oh, you want a whole paragraph on your wrist? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Like, all that shit. Serenity prayers. All of this fucking <laughs> shit. Like, you know? <laughs> God, oh, give me the strength to yep, fucking that get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> all of that shit, you know? Because no. you got to do it huge. You know, Yo, that shit is crazy. The words and all of that shit, all of the little cursive E's where there's little circles inside and little shit that you gotta... People don't think about that but shit. Yeah, that's what I mean. That, that's what I was saying. I need my, like, a fucking book or something, you know? There's just... Niggas wouldn't read it, though. I need a video. <laughs> <laughs> I, I need a video. That's what I need. <laughs> Ten seconds each. Yeah, like, quick. <laughs> don't do this. Boom, then you're, then you're good. 
<laughs> people <laughs> might listen that way. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a little TikTok. What's that? That new shit that people You went to the, like, oh, yeah. the history of tattooing? Like, in some sense, I don't... Like I said, I'm completely self-taught, so I kind of only learned about the things that I'm interested in. What it, what, what do you mean, like history? Like, shit like when it was, shit. like what? Like when it came from shit like that. Like I seen yeah. shit back in the day, like that, that fucking yeah, that tapping in shit. That shit is hard body. That shit, is, yakuza shit. That shit, that shit. <laughs> fucking yeah, yeah. If you ever been to a tattoo convention, anybody? Nah. Shit is yeah. around here. It's it, that's what I mean. Even before I started tattooing, I didn't know this shit. You can go to a fucking tattoo convention anytime. You're fucking everywhere. It's like twenty bucks to get in. And it's just a bunch of niggas in there tattooing. Like, straight up. Mad shit. You can get Dope your shit, though? Yeah. Dope artists. Like, Tommy's. Tommy's is where I get my supplies. It's in Connecticut. Summer's, Summer's Connecticut. Not that far. But um, they do a convention every year. It just passed. Y'all missed it. But... <laughs> <laughs> but, um... There's other ones. New York. Fucking, um... Boston... Worcester, there's a bunch of them. It's just a bunch of artists. If they're in the area or they want to be in the area, they just go there and it's in the convention center. It's just a bunch of, a big ass space with a bunch of niggas in it. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Tattooing and, and you can, anybody can go there, get tattooed by famous people. There's famous people there sometimes and, you know. What do you think about Ink Master? I like it. I like Ink Master better than like Black Ink and shit. Yeah, I definitely don't watch that shit at all. That's just drama. It yeah. makes black artists look like bad. That's what I think about Black. I mean, about Ink Master too, though. It's 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 like scripted. I got an invite to Ink Master before. I think I've seen that back in the day. It was, and if you know what's crazy, what was what? Not even the fact that I got an invite because I felt like I. The reason I didn't like go super hard on it was I felt like I was gonna be one of those fucking filler guys again. Kicked out mad quick. It's just, <laughs> you know, you I was about to like, you should have, yeah, you should have. Fucked no, I, I tried. I did. I, I was on both sides. I did try, and I. But like I said, we went through mad owners and shit. So at that time when that happened, uh, um, the owner was in between selling the shop to another <coughs> owner, and we had emails and shit like that. They hit me up on the shop's email, and then we didn't have that email anymore. So I don't know what God, happened. Yeah, that's that. ass. But you know, I got. I didn't. I never. I never tried to get on Ink Master and shit. It was just from my Instagram. One of their fucking people that fucking search found me on Instagram, like seeing my shit and seeing I was tagging that Team Jones shit all the time. <laughs> they see me from that shit and they fucking sent me an invite and that's that's kind. That's why I never tried again. I was kind of on that shit. Yeah, my fault. I'm you know chit chatting and shit. Kobe. <laughs> I should have used a different sports guy. <laughs> I'm not really Shit, into the sports that much. Yeah. Oh, no. Now you're putting me on the spot. Right? Yeah. <laughs> but, um. Nope. I forgot what I was talking about. Ink Master. Ink Master. Oh, yeah. Ink Master. When I did my interview, I did a Skype interview. And that shit was like. I was cool. They asked me a lot of questions and shit. And then I had to do like a fucking thing at the end. It was like, so this one here is for the producers and shit. And no, it was actually for the for the show and shit. You know how they do like a like a little close up of the artist and it's like I'm I'm this guy and I'm gonna win and fucking all you guys should go home. That's what they wanted me to do, basically. Like, <laughs> right, I'm not about that life. I'm not talking shit about anybody right. else or anything like that. I did it, though, because you can win a hundred racks. And I, <laughs> you know, I was like, all you motherfuckers go home. Yeah. You know, but it, it was super scripted. You know, they wanted me to act like I was fucking, like, super cocky and, like, fucking get the fuck out of here. That's why. Because I got this shit. And I wasn't about that life, really. I did it, but you could tell I was kind of reluctant. No worries. That's whack. Yeah. Damn. I'm with it. Black ink sucks. Yeah, I don't fuck We're with We're on the internet. Shit. I don't know if I should have said that. I'm going to get Jones tattoos on the way. Right. <laughs> nah, I don't fuck with that show. But that's right. Like, you're you're it's a tattoo like a, artist. It's, it's, like a, it's like a drama <laughs> thing. You know, you don't even see that many tattoos or anything. You don't see what anybody's doing. It's just like... <laughs> This nigga's baby's mom busted his windows out. No, <laughs> should, we should do the real version. Yeah, that's what I mean. I'm the only black guy, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? You're the only one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. 
<laughs> but you know, it's like a thing. You know, I'm I'm trying to, I'm trying to make money. I'm down to fucking, like I said, I had two apprentices. I'm down to teach people because it's it's like if there's dope artists out there, there there are. You buy your artist? Yeah. yeah. It's there's a thing. You know, it's I want some money though. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, it's a, you know, it's like college, y'all. I'm giving people careers. You know, people. You know, my my two apprentices. This this motherfucker, she still has a job because you know she's about to. She's not here. I'm just pointing. Oh, I'm like, like, like oh. yeah, that's her room over there. But Jay, he ain't had another job since either. Word. You know, that shit, and that's from from me specifically. You know, he came to me, and I I fucking taught him enough to where I was like, yo, you're ready to get a license. I can only I can get him a license. I can get his license for him because I'm licensed. You know, so I got him a license, and he ain't had a fucking job since either. You know, how does that work? And you gotta, there's things you gotta do. It's not just give people a license. You gotta, you gotta be first aid certified, CPA, I mean, CPR certified. You gotta do a skin course. You gotta have, um, the health, yeah, infection control. Fucking, um, you gotta have the health department sign off on it, you know, to get your license. You can only be licensed in the city you're in. And then, you know, if you want to tattoo outside the city, you got to go to the city's health department that you're in and get, get licensed there. You don't oh, have shit, to, but if, if you want is. to, if you want to, then, you know, if you want to do it legally, then that's what you have to do. And it's like, it's not, it's not, it's not shit to be, it's less real, you know, that's fucking spreading fucking blood and shit, you know, <laughs> there's all your gloves and shit, you're touching your bottles, your ink. You know, you could be in the middle of a tattoo, and if you got your gloves on and you need fucking blue ink, you gotta fucking take your gloves off and fucking get the blue ink and then put some more gloves on. So that's, imagine how many gloves you go through in a day. You know, imagine how many paper towels you go through in a, in a fucking week. All of this shit is mad fucking money, yo. And then people are like, you charge too much. Nigga, I charge. Just enough. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> You know, you know, the, the first, I just went to 120 an hour. I charged a hundred dollars an hour for 10 years. I went up $20 niggas and niggas is fucking pissed. Niggas is pissed. Like, damn. Like, 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 Too by somebody else, and then they holla at me again for the cover up. <laughs> and it's gonna be more expensive now, it's gonna take longer. <laughs> it's gonna be, you know, yeah. it's just like right. it's a cycle, <laughs> a horrible cycle. <laughs> this is gonna be fucking awkward. Let's do it. <laughs> is Roadhead dangerous? <laughs> Obviously, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not actually not with it. You're not, no, I'm uh, I like the safety. <laughs> yeah, that you shit know, is that shit you is mad be, uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. Like, you ever be driving? And you got to use your right leg. So? You got to use your right leg, and that's what it is. is. A miniature what, person. What it is is he's got all the phone books that he's sitting. Right. He's, trying to, he's trying to focus on his tippy toe touching that yeah, fucking like, gas. Hey, <laughs> yo, that's the thing, you know. You can't focus on she's got her weight on that right leg. This she's got her back. weight on that leg. You can't fucking lift up when you need to lift up and switch to the brake. Right. You nah, can't even got control. I never no reaction. Shit. No reaction <laughs> time. Fuck you you said you can't. Amateurs. You say you don't? That's how you fuck with it. I can't. I don't fuck with it either. We gotta be in the desert. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. We gotta be on the desert. Yeah. We gotta be like on a straight road. Oh, no okay, turns, no traffic. No traffic. traffic. That shit is damn near a requirement right. Cruise over control. a ride over yeah. 20 minutes. Right. Oh, right. 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 This is not going to be more than 20 minutes. I just minutes. wanted to buy Look. a cruise control. Right. <laughs> you might throw a in the park. I just park. got a cruise control. I just got a cruise control. I just got a cruise control. 21.6 minute ride. These last to be seconds of this. That shit is OD. I can wait. It's like five minutes. Let me just pull over somewhere. Yeah, cruise control. Yeah, so it's cruise control. Right. That's a wrap. Right. That's good shit. I never thought about that. Shit. Middle lane. 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 <laughs> just sit behind the semi. You be cool. I don't know. I'm a, yeah, I'm interactive. <laughs> yeah. You know? That too, like that yeah, shit. Right. That shit is I, right. It's just too much thinking going on. Too much For shit. Real. You know. 
I gotta fucking pay attention to the road. I'm not trying to kill anybody, <laughs> myself or others. I'm That's when you know you're getting a wag head and you can drive and at the same right, time. Yeah, yeah, right, 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 I never told this story from yesterday. About, what story? Uh, I asked the question: Have you ever, have you ever been so confident that you were gonna win something, and then you fucking failed miserably at it? Um, I can't think of it. <laughs> <laughs> no, he he had an interesting story. I don't win. <laughs> I just don't fucking everything. do shit I, I don't. Think I can win, me. right? You know? <laughs> you know? If I think I can win it, then I'll do it. Otherwise, I'm not really fucking with it. So, all right. especially in front of people. A long ass time ago, uh, when I, after one of my parties in like, I don't know, I think it was in high school, either high school or eighth grade, one of the fucking two. But we were outside, I mean, we were all fucking athletes. And niggas talk, I'm faster than you, not faster than you, I'm faster than you. He's like, all right, probably let's go outside and see who's fucking. Like, I'm about to burn all y'all motherfuckers, right? We go outside, and literally, out of fucking nowhere, this crackhead comes out. Like, <laughs> <laughs> this crackhead comes up to us, and we run a block. Just like, hey, how you doing? Y'all running? Y'all racing? I was like, yeah, he did. He didn't even. He didn't just say nothing. This dude took like ten steps back. Ten steps back. We're like on your mark. Is like a head start. This nigga was good. When I say track star, I mean like this dude could have been an Olympian. Crack star. This nigga's a crack star. That's it. That's it. You get your heart rate up to 205 BPM. Yeah. Yo, I've never seen. I've never seen anybody run that fast in my fucking life. And I've seen. I've seen. That's what we were talking about, Tyler. You saw Tyler. That's what crack. And then he went for the I never He's seen. Heavy looking I never seen, seen you run too on top. Niggas is racing. Nah, I know. Like, <laughs> ran track. I mean, running back, but still. I, that's what I'm saying. I was like, I'm about to go out there and smoke all y'all. Like, I'm, about, I'm, yeah, I'm winning. Really smoke. Nah, I'm winning. This, this guy, this guy I was like, really <laughs> like, is that a light bulb, nigga? <laughs> Yo, that shit is raw. And that nigga, he fucking cooked us. Literally. Like, that nigga, like, like, I know this dude who would, who would light up crack, bro, and every time, as soon as he was done, he would want some shit like that. Like, y'all want to do a push up contest right now? Yeah. And it's just like, chill. Calm the fuck down. I know How a many push up guy or arm wrestling guy. I know. <laughs> he said every time. How like, many times you chill with the crackhead? Y'all seen that? So, <laughs> I know you brought this cracking up a couple times. You can't, you can't help who your family is. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. They're not the same one. <laughs> I had some crackheads in my family. That's that shit too, yo. I said some shit about my family the other day. Ain't nobody this fucking family perfect. Ain't right. nobody family, yo. If you gonna come on and act like you're fucking family perfect, then hey, hey. then you're, you're lying. Nigga, that's, that you're shit's lying. whack. Right. My that shit is perfect. Nobody in my family smokes crack for the record. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. right. I, did, you know, you say, I had to clear you know, that. Like a Thanksgiving dinner with an expert. <laughs> Y'all were saying, what, what you talking crack? about? <laughs> Matthew, Maddie, come sit down. Who's the crack <laughs> patient? <laughs> Next to the pumpkin pie. <laughs> Yo, y'all seen that that teacher and student uh, fight? Oh, yeah. That shit I don't know why out. I seen him. He was going in, though. I think the kid was being fucking racist. Like, not being I don't know what the fuck. I think that's what the fuck. Yeah, so let's get the fuck said, down. But boy, was that teacher, though. They came with that right. People are I was like, like ooh. People are, like, defending the teacher, though. But I think it's Nah, me. nah. It ain't no defending the teacher. He had no business the community putting raised his hands money. on that boy. Yeah, yeah. They, 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 they raised, like, thousands and thousands of dollars It was racist shit. Legal it was racist you know, shit. Like, he was saying racist uh, shit. Hard he body. had yeah. no right. Yeah, 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 I agree. He had no right. I don't give a fuck. Yo, he beat the... He beat the... He had all right. He had all right. And that kid 
caught a couple good shots too, though. Nah, he did. He did. I see. I see that nice little one too. That left. That left. Oh, yes. 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 Like don't don't yeah. don't. But not from your teacher though. You don't. Yeah, you, your no, teacher can't talk. give it to you. Nah, that's Why that not? shit though. Nigga, back in the day, it. teachers used to look at it. Rumors and all that shit. That's bad. That teacher used to look at it. I don't know. 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 Bet on it, buddy. Who? Right. That's just going to fucking jail. Demographic and like who was black? Nah, neither one of them were. Yeah, Spanish kid and black teacher. Both minorities. Both niggas. He's a teacher. He's going down there. Nah, he's a teacher. Yeah, he's a teacher. He's a goddamn adult. Shit out there. That nigga fucked that kid up. Yeah, he got fucked up. It's so funny. But I'm not supposed to be laughing at something like that. He I'm sorry. I was just the way he fucked him up. Yeah. He had to call him a nigga. He didn't say something about his mama. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what he said. He was talking about his wife. Yeah, that shit. It was, was some real shit. Cool. That nigga was going. Cool. He was trying. You could just see. And it was real. He was trying so hard not to do nothing. He was just like, it was just built up and built up. But that kid hooked off on him, and that was it. Mm, that kid didn't know what hit him. Yo, he was like, nah, he was still oh, in there. He was still in there. Not at first. At, not at well, first. yeah, obviously. But he teacher was just like, you high school. Mm-hmm. I mean, like, you ain't gonna be in there first either. Good. What's that shit? Like, what's that shit? Like, what's that shit? 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 What's that Right, you gotta register, <laughs> my nigga. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you know that shot. You know that's like getting punched in the face for the first time. Yo, you know your shit, first punch in the face, nigga. Like, yeah. mine was a bloody nose. It was from um, fucking. Larry Johnson. <laughs> you remember Lil Larry? You remember Lil Larry? It was in karate class. This nigga oh, fucking busted right, my lip, nigga. I was like, oh, this nigga's serious. I thought you were laughing. You know? Like, what are those shit like? He just studied this week. <laughs> he never forgot his name. It was Lil Larry. Nah, no. yeah. The way he said his, his name, name, I thought this nigga was, was, was going like, to say he took his lunch money or something. That's why I started laughing. I was going to be like, damn. That's the thing too it's crazy because you know i've never been like a tough guy or not i've never been none of that shit but i never really was i never had beef with nobody or nothing so there have been times i'd be downtown when i was a teenager and shit and we fucking walking home and niggas would be like fucking guns out robbing us straight up and they'd be like is that mike i'm like yes (laughs) 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 you're like cool come over here i was like all right <laughs> and you just robbed me. Yeah, yeah. Give them, give them, give us this shit. You know, yeah. yeah. Like, it was all that shit. Like, that's how that shit goes. Go. Go. That's how that shit go. That's how that shit go. That's how I got caught up. That's how I got caught up. It's always some shit like that. It's like, you know, it's like, I ain't had no beef with nobody. So it was just, I just know niggas were cool. Then it was always art for me, too. Like, I was always drawing or fucking doing something to fucking. Niggas just know that, and it's cool. It's like the niggas in jail. If you're a fucking artist shit. in jail, you're fucking good, nigga. <laughs> right? Draw you're good. Daughter. I'll draw you a picture yeah, right now, my nigga. Draw my daughter. All right. All right. right. You want to put some dope up, shit on your baby's mind? I got just you. Draw her ass. Butt ass nigga. I got you. 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 That's so like, now that's, I got caught up like that too. Like, Yo, that's what I mean. I, I bet you a bunch of niggas like, 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 <laughs> like niggas know that shit. Nigga. It's like, oh, I know this nigga. Not not nigga. We know some crazy niggas, you know. I know some crazy, crazy motherfuckers. Goddamn time and shit like that. You just always around it and just like, oh, you down? Like, I'm, I'm what? Now you down? Like, alright, guys. Niggas, niggas, niggas in the set look like y'all not about to jump him. I'm just like. You heard what he said. You heard what he said. Nah, that's that cool. shit. Like that, that, 
shit. Your that's product, your environment. Like that. Mm. That's how that. That's how that shit goes. I mean, I was just um, scared straight. I was in Chicago. Oh, yeah. For yeah. Really? <laughs> we went for church though. But so we went there. You can see when they had the old elevators with the little thing that go by. So when you come down, you can see the floor first. So they mm-hmm. staged the fight. Everybody was scared, but I saw it. And once they was like, my, my parents just wanted me to go. I wasn't a bad kid just to mm-hmm. see how it is. Mm-hmm. Niggas was like, nah, he's good. Niggas grabbed me by the shirt. Like, nah, he said I was good. Like, I'm, not good. I'm good. I'm good. Hey, I was an observation. Don't touch me. 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 Nigga, pull that nigga's shirt. <laughs> this nigga, you know who Andrew Schultz is? No. It sounds familiar, that last he's name. Comedian. Schultz. Comedian. Oh, no. He's comedian. I was thinking of some story shit, sorry. This motherfucker said uh, he has a way. He said he figured out how motherfuckers could stop getting raped and they drop the soap and shit like that. He was like, they have all the jails have liquid soap. <laughs> That's that the thing, shit. Though. The only thing that. How, they I just think, set niggas yeah. up on purpose that if they haven't done that by now, that's like the same shit with like Ziploc cereal. Like, how come that shit hasn't happened? Yet? I think niggas don't care if you got soap or not. You know what that means? That's what I mean. I think that's all stupid shit. Niggas don't care if you got soap or not. If they want it, they're taking it. That's I'm different. I don't want to rape Right, right. It hasn't been sober yet. It hasn't been sober yet. It hasn't been in his ashtray. He wouldn't even smoke him. 45 days in jail. Yeah, where, where is the murderers? <laughs> yeah. the killers. He killers. the murderers and the killers and the rapists. <laughs> Straight up. 45 days, days in jail. Where was this at? Atlanta. Yeah, South, South Carolina. South Carolina. South, 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 South. All the yeah, all, all they they not fuck that shit up. Straight up. Nigga Every time even I go up there, my niggas don't want to even smoke in the car. <laughs> he wasn't even smoking. You got smoke that nigga. Like, what you doing? Nigga, 45 days. Right here at the red light? With the killers. With the hard They said this shit is 30 to 45 days or 10 bins. Yo. Well, three beans, three beans, three beans. It's it's ten percent. It's ten percent of thirty thousand. So you would either have to forty five bins. Right, with the killers and shit. The niggas don't give a fuck. They're in jail for life. Obviously, they don't want to fuck you. Weed. That's why everybody should have went out of the booty yesterday. You gotta keep going out. Fucking, fucking weed. weed. Shit. Not up here, but like shit, we good with the weed. But shit, the south. Soon as you start crossing them, lines, I know. Hey, you <laughs> crossed them. Lines. What? So I'm supposed to stay in Connecticut? Home? <laughs> I know. Stay home. Yeah, yeah, like, Connecticut. Connecticut. Hey, Connecticut. Hey, Connecticut. West Farms. Hey, yeah. <laughs> that shit was fucking jail. crazy. Yeah, it is crazy. You you always tattoo stone? Um, yeah, kind of. Unless I, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm semi-professional in the sense where, like, <laughs> in that sense where, you know, if I ask people, I tell people if if they're cool and smoking, I'll smoke in here. And if they're not, then, I'll, you know, I'm going to take a, a smoke break and I'll go. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Either way, I'm getting high. Either way, I'm fucking smoking. You know what I mean? I'm a passionate runner. I'm going to go. Yeah, you know? You want this fire-ass tattoo or not? Right. You know, because I'm not high. That's the thing. No, either way, I'm good. I'm I'm good. I've always nah. been an artist way before I was smoking weed. But Lord. I I, mean, I like to. Smoke. You took art at Central. I took art. Oh, Miss Tuttle, yeah. she's a shit. Miss Tuttle. Yeah. I that's have. that's dope. I want to give a shout out. To my nigga Miss Tuttle. Yeah. My she real, yeah. She 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 you know who else? You remember from the Boys and Girls Club? Uh, it was an arts and craft lady named fucking Jessica. It was a white lady. Uh, fucking. Uh, <laughs> Tom, you She had fucking hair all the way down to the Jessie. floor. Yeah. You gotta shout her out too? Hell yeah, this is what this is. 
Tell her M. Jones tattoo says thank you. Cause she was like, you know, that was like a lot of my my you know artistic inspiration. I feel like people need that fucking, you know, somebody to tell you to fucking look at this. This shit is dope, you know? Something like that, you know, to to see, you know, the art and fucking everything, you know, because people want stupid shit. I've tattooed fucking Pyrexes and fucking crack bowls on people. <laughs> shit, you know? shit, shit. shit is real. You know, Yo. people get, you know, their life. Where's Just, the worst place you've tatted on somebody? The worst place or in what sense? Like the weirdest place or something. <clears throat> or or I've, uncomfortable place. Because Dane's trying to get an I've asshole. I've tattooed that. I'm saying he wants a straight star in his asshole. No. D- 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 uh, <laughs> Dane wants to help me. I've tattooed that. 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 I've I'm with what, it. what is that phrase start with? Over that? Um, I told I, I did a. That shit got started like twenty bands. Twenty bands in there, my nigga. Twenty bands in there, my nigga. The thing with that is, is you kind of trying to scare them away, but you kind of not. You still want the money, you know. So you'll tell them something high, but you won't tell them something fucking too high and shit like that. What I did, it was a group of guys. They were from Winnick, oh, and they no. were on the um. Like the lacrosse team, I don't think when it got like a football team. Oh, <laughs> like, it was like a lacrosse or some shit like that. Yeah. One of those like, sports, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 All of them on their butt cheek. Maybe it was a dare or something like that. You know, you in the fucking military. You know about a dare. Yeah, he know about nothing. Whatever butt. for a dare. I've done. I've done nah, mad no, dare no. tattoos. I've done mad dare tattoos nah, too. Yeah, I've seen some but dare shit. you know, it was a dare shit. So they all got it on their butt. Foghorn Leghorn. It was this big. Two hundred bucks each. So you sat there and said that three guys asses. It was four guys. So you did. He made sure he knew. So you did four guys' asses. Yeah. For eight hundred bucks. For eight hundred dollars, you did four did. guys. Hey, it was like, two hours. Everybody got a price. <laughs> everybody got a price <laughs> for, for two hours. I got eight hundred bucks for looking at a guy's butt and touching it with gloves on. <laughs> yeah. With color? We, Stop! You got the color? That's not even enough for one. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, 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 yeah. You know? But, you know, oh, yeah, I'm with this right now. I won't tattoo a dude's dick or nothing. I know you smoke the hell out of weed. Nah, that was fucking winning white kids. And that was, that wasn't, that was like, I didn't have, that was when somebody else owned the shop and shit. I used to smoke outside, dude. Would it have been a deal breaker if one of them in your face? <laughs> uh, it happens, I guess, but. It was, I it was <laughs> it was Motherfuckers usually got control of their bowels and shit at a young age. Ain't no old motherfucker getting an ass tattooed. So I never had it happen, but, you know. You just jacked the person. handle it. <laughs> 800 more, motherfucker. Yeah, I, I, I know. Change this shit. Queef McGee. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I seen some stories can you, today. Can you pass that drink down here, please? I seen some stories today. I didn't read it. I just it's seen a headline. Head some <laughs> chick, some chick gave her man, I guess, her <laughs> kidney, and then and he <laughs> dumped her out. Yeah. 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 Wow! Yeah. 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 Wow! Yeah. 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 I know, all right. Yeah, but he didn't ask for it. Yeah, I mean, that nigga different. baked cakes for that motherfucker. That's different didn't. if he didn't ask for it, though. Jeez, if he didn't ask for it, that's different. That's that's he didn't ask for that responsibility. <laughs> He ain't asked for none of that. Niggas just Let me love. die. Yeah, <laughs> Niggas ain't got no Was heart. they together before? Yeah, I'd assume so. You so, don't know. Or maybe maybe, maybe they're, they're just, just fucking I mean, crazy ass chicks that are like, right. oh, yeah, right. I don't do anything for you. Right. Right. No. Right. 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 No. Right. 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 You never know. I ain't <laughs> asked for you right. later, bitch. I don't even know you like that. I would have never asked for you. I would have never asked for your kidneys. How do you know we was a match? 
I just knew. That's mad <laughs> stalkerish. What if she did know, like, 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 nigga, like. I, I would have. I wouldn't want. I know. You know I work at the what, house, what if that's what it was? What if he <laughs> did? A, what, if, what if she did all that? Like, I wouldn't want to be with her either. Like I thank you. Don't think I hip up. Right. <laughs> right. right. Nah, nigga. Nigga won't know if she's stalking your ass. This is our blood type and shit. <laughs> she oh, yeah. That shit is crazy. Yeah, that shit's real. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. You know the nigga. <laughs> right. Yeah. Anybody ever faking that? Um, it's a bunch of niggas. niggas Who has that? I, I see this. Niggas dude, do that? Talking yes. about today. <laughs> wow, what? y'all niggas oh, are sick. Oh, 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 yeah. I got a perfect nigga outside and shit. Oh, niggas outside? No, what type of shit y'all niggas is. Yo, I'm off this podcast, man. Niggas speaking nuts talking about my niggas outside. I'm done. Yo, that's not I'm bad. done. I'm leaving. Y'all niggas is all suspect. <laughs> 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 I'm I'm quit. I'm yeah. quit. I'm fired. Yeah. I ain't never heard no shit yeah. like this. I ain't gonna put this is where I draw the line. I'm just gonna say, first time shit. This is what you got with this nigga out here. Nah, nigga. I'm not thinking no neck. I never thinking no neck. I ain't thinking no neck. Tell no bitch my thinking. Never, never, never. I got how about this pussy, my nigga, I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> never, nigga. Ever. If I'm in it, I'm in it to win it, brother. What do you mean? Hey, what? Hey, brother, I'm doing numbers, brother. What you mean? Oh, I'm yeah, doing numbers because I'm in it to win it. I don't fix nothing, brother. Oh, I don't think it's a good time to escape. Nah, yo. I didn't know. I wanted to ask her how. I never. I didn't know niggas do that shit. This is crazy. You never been so so wasted. No, nah, that's a shit. I'll that, be like, like I, I can't. That's, that's when I turn to a porn star. Nah, yeah, that's, 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 going that's going like three, no. four hours. That's, that's why she be like, Are you fucking kidding me? Who are you? I can't the whole 12 play tonight. Niggas just don't nut. I was like, Oh my god. Like, but yeah. still, nigga, the fake and nut. Like, uh, uh, uh. Oh no. Nigga, ask for a sandwich out there. Oh, B. Trying to take a nap. Fucking hungry. Not you on the bitch. Oh, my God. I think the nut sound on the bitch and did some wild shit. This nigga said the nut sound. What's the nut sound? What? What's the nut sound? Ah, ah, ah. She don't even believe you. Cause she like turned around, and I hit her right. You know what I'm saying? Right in the face with it. You know what I'm saying? She's a little, 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 you know what I'm saying? Yo. Them little bust down chicks, you little, but it wasn't no fake nut. I just faked the sound for her to be like, turn and then pow. Yeah. <laughs> you dirty, you dirty. Yes, You got this. I said, oh, no. Oh, oh. What are you doing? This nigga Dave is dirty. Why are you going to warn me? That would have been the defeat of purpose. That's why I warned you. And you want to let it go down oh like that. Oh my god. Yeah, the look on your face, it was priceless. That's what I wanted. Now that's different. Oh my god. I ain't faking that for some shit like that. That's cool. But I That's cool faking that. Yo, my nigga is If I'm like, yo, I got to go, my nigga is here. She's going to look at me like, nigga, what? What the fuck did you just say to me, nigga? Yeah. <laughs> we gonna talk about this. <laughs> you like, you know, I know you was mid like yeah. shot, but um, yeah. my nigga like blowing me up. Like we supposed to match. <laughs> like, oh, we oh. had shit to do. <laughs> this nigga's an idiot. Get your gas. Who's <laughs> call me? Who's my number, man? <laughs> That's the point. He's the one. <laughs> Yo, John, you wild. I don't know about your logic, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That oh. man's been right. You <laughs> said you should laugh. Right. Oh, I feel you. You said her shit was trash, so what you, what you got to prove? That's when you just disrespect her, though. You know what I mean? You fucking dog shit out of her. You put your fucking foot on the back of her head and shit. Then you pull up your handcuffs and you tie up her fucking ankles with her fucking wrist. And you go, hey, you gonna do this trash ass pussy with 
You put a fucking bed in this between the pillowcase and the fucking love seat, nigga. And then you wait till she say the fucking uh, zap out work. This nigga's mad aggressive. Talk to me. Talk to me. You start fisting her neck. I literally just remember just showed you in my front. Man, it's all good. Yeah, a whole lot of inappropriate shit goes on. Yeah, that's what it's called. We know. This is the meeting before the fucking what's the name? This shit going I, I was trying to have this conversation. Yeah, we didn't know what was, what was happening. Well, what's, I tried to have this conversation with Daisy before too about why niggas beat off before go seeing a chick. It's like, it's either either what? Girls don't know. Who the does that? Listen, what? what? Wait, what? No, this no, 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 nigga. Like you are talking about that weirdo. Why are you doing that? What you mean? What, what? 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 You what? do you what? mean? What? What? So you can fucking last one? Right. So you know, not, hey, that first nut, nigga. That first nut is not about the fucking. I'm not. Niggas. Wow. What? Y'all niggas is fucking. Y'all niggas, niggas do that shit. You about to find out. I got to find out what niggas do. How? Why? Would I comment on this shit? What niggas do? Cause niggas gotta comment on this shit. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was just saying. Y'all talking real sus? And no, nigga, you bugging. That's how the words. You bugging. You bugging. You didn't hear. Niggas said I beat off. I go see the bitch. Yeah. So I walk in the room ready, like nigga. Yes. Nigga, no, bro. Yes. Oh, who raised you? Nigga, I don't know what the fuck you talking about. Nigga, I don't know what you talking about. This is what Nigga. this is what black men are going this, to this is what this, this is the state of emergency like, black men. We need to change this shit today. But you didn't got a second yeah. reason because like sometimes niggas be like niggas. I had that reassurance. Like sometimes you never want. You never just fucking. You have to though. Get that first thing. Sometimes you're like, I don't want to go over there. He's like, no, no. Like, I don't want to go over there. Like, 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 like if I really heard this shit before, it'd be different. This like, 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 nigga, you never nothing be like, yo, I'm not going over there. I'm not going to see that bitch because. I don't gotta deal yeah, with it. Yeah, I don't yeah. wanna deal with it. And that's right. that's what you're trying to find Wait, out. What well, she was too much for you? No, no nigga. It's just so like what do you mean? What do you mean? Like, if, like, if the bitch is whack, you're like, you about to go over there just to fucking get some. You're like, right. man. Yeah, I'm not going to let you know. I'm trying to find out. Max got hit regardless. I'm not going to let you know. Max CV Johnny. I'm not going to let you know. I'm, not I'm about Jordan about every time, nigga. There's no about excuse about for Jordan not to come to work. This is the difference between I'm not talking about Jordan, about Jordan coming to work. Nigga, no. Jordan, 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 Jordan coming to work. Nah, nigga. I'm I am going four to five by five, nigga. This nigga. Triple double, nigga. I'm not going triple double. Thank you. I'm not going to I'm texting Dean. Call me five minutes. That's yo, that shit. Nigga, no, sometimes, again, nigga, some, nigga, yo, 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 you have like, you never just had that whack pussy on dial, like, damn, like, I ain't getting her in a while. Like, damn, I could, should I, should right, I right, hit right, to me? That's right. not whack yeah, pussy, that's yeah. needy pussy. I don't keep whack pussy around. Yeah, yeah, you ever seen you Whack pussy, that. you hit it one time, you forget it. So then you was whack and I never fucked you again. Needy pussy is that shit that I'd be like, oh, no. <laughs> Cause she no, goes, goes she she she, she the one you're supposed to have up at two three o'clock in the morning. It's like right. she gonna act. Uh, she gonna fall in love again. Yeah, right that shit. She gonna start texting That's what I'm good morning, saying. Good night so again. before you go make that mistake, you get that nut out the way. Like, God, I'm good. I ain't gonna. Nah, nah, nah. I still gotta bust her ass. See, that's that shit. You take anything down. You take anything and everything. You just said you're gonna fuck her, but you're gonna give her weak dick. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna go over there. He gonna jerk off. He gonna, he gonna get off on himself. This is like fuck. Man. But that's that shit though. If the bitch bad. <laughs> what the fuck this nigga talking about? I don't know. If this bad. bitch bad, fuck. <laughs> you know, I don't fucking know. And go over there. He's taking it out. He's taking it out. He's taking it out. I can't. Y'all niggas is bugging. I ain't getting my shit. <laughs> Yeah, it is a bugger. He's walking in. He's walking in here smelling like he's been dealing with chains. Don't fuck with him. You work at the bank? Do you work at the bank or something? Do you work for the liquor store like the coin machine? <laughs> Why are y'all stick? See, this is that shit too, yo. This is your all hands young smell shit. smell like mercury. I've been fucking married for I don't know how long, too. So. Your hands got that real mercury smell. Y'all niggas who be fucking chicks like crazy <laughs> now. This ain't this ain't now. <laughs> so that shit, that shit, that shit is mad funny. Oh my god, yeah. Oh shit. Uh, where can everybody find your shit? <laughs> what? Where can everybody find your shit at? Um, uh, <laughs> my work. M Jones yeah. is on Instagram. Oh my and um, Mike Jonesy Jones on Facebook. I don't got no <coughs> like that. I want to, I want to picture spot. <laughs> no word.
Yo, thank you for fucking having this conversation. Yeah, yeah, fuck yeah. around, man. Yeah. You're a bunch of fucking fools, yo. I got two of my shit. Right. Oh, where? Right. Right. He didn't want me to say I couldn't get color until I did it right. I was about to say, you probably wanted a black people in this time. Well, yeah, that's everybody. Even you, too. What do you mean? Yeah. I'm not part of the Me Too movement. Anyway, why you yeah, but you know, you probably got some small tattoos. You probably got some stuff that need fixing too. I got a lot of shit. By Bill. By Bill, right. You know, All my ones that need to fix them is by your boy Bill. The 400 bill. <laughs> no, 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 no. Right. For Hi, the, Bill. For the $40 See, that's, bill. See, that's the part you know? he, ain't, he ain't mentioned. Hi, Bill, mm-hmm. motherfucker. Because <laughs> if you can work well, high, I don't mean like Bill can work high. Now, mm-hmm. that's you as the. The That's customer a, like, this nigga's a little too high. <laughs> <laughs> I had to pick his head off the floor three times to finish. Bro, you gonna finish Ray, my tattoo? <laughs> Bro, you gonna finish my tattoo? Yo, this is all I heard about dude. This is talking about, I'm like, yo, how, how many people done went to this dude? I heard mad people go to this because man. Because just like he said, if you call him with $20, he gonna do your tattoo. Right, nigga, so I, if niggas is lowballing, then you, 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 you just want it. You just want it. That's the, right. That's the you just one. That's the unneedy pussy tag right there. Right. Ooh. This guy stayed killing us. Your last right. Was one of them is like a motherfucker. Right. Was that yesterday? Was yesterday? <laughs> <laughs> nigga said the Sam. needy pussy tag, brother. You young niggas, stop going to, to tell these young niggas that. You should there, put that shit on the wall. Don't try to make you young say, niggas hey, stop hey, going hey. to get the needy pussy tag. Hey, hey. Put it on the wall. You heard what my artist <laughs> said? My <laughs> artist gave you some jewels, man. Dropping the jewels. Alright, the tattoo artist. It's inappropriate. Hmm? Tattoo? What, what happened? Happen? This guy. He's got a tattoo artist. Man. This guy. Yeah, you ain't not. Brother, the agency's getting big, bro. Like Rodney. I know, we're doing everything. <laughs> everything. We really are. That money's <laughs> I know. Look, we good over here. <laughs> 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 we'll burn it. We kill all the Ramans. <laughs> All the rhyming. Make it rain. Listen. Make it rain on them hoes. Listen. Make it rain on them hoes. Make it rain on them hoes. Mike Torch, Matt Quay, Matt, thank you for having us again. We out yes, this sir. bitch. Yeah. Shout out our sponsors, Haiku, Isaiah, hit him up. Yes, sir. Oh, I didn't Ooh, it is spread rain. You ain't yeah. it. Tom, Tom, make sure you tell these coons pick your fucking money up and put that shit back the way it was. I'll say exactly like a <laughs> Listen here, coons. <laughs> it's gonna be that teacher and that kid again. I know. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Yeah, Matthew Kim Thompson. Yeah, please. Yeah, this should look like the most latest party of some.